party was his uh, brainchild. He came up with the idea. He sponsored the um, the space right here, as well as um, he bought uh, some of, of the drinks for us. So, uh, Bruce. Um, I'm glad everybody can come out. I know uh, just to be out of the sunshine or somewhere a tad bit cool is a, a good idea today, although there's always something fun going on in Millennium Park. And I hear there are a great couple of groups over there tonight, but uh, being out baking uh, is, a, is kind of tough here, but thank you guys for coming out. Uh, uh, again, this is something that is uh, uh, Raymond from Cuttlefish, is he? He's here. Uh, he's he's really a guy that uh, really helped uh, introduce a, a lot of us and, and pull us into this concept. Many of us have been working in various aspects of IT and technology. Uh, I've been in the technology field here in Chicago for a long time. I'm very active in Chicago's uh, tech community. I'm on the board of the Illinois Technology Association, which is a leading or organization in the state of Illinois for IT and software and uh, IT and communication services firms. We're almost up to about 800 members now in Chicago. Many of you know us for, because of Tech Nexus and uh, our activities at 200 South Wacker. But this is a continuing effort to recognize so many areas of Chicago's uh, business and entrepreneurial community that's really growing. And many of us have felt for a long time that mobile was was hot and was strong in Chicago. We felt that it was time for really to be recognized not only as a great uh, consumer, but a great innovator of mobile applications and mobile technologies. And I would say to uh, everyone that's thinking about opportunities in this field, there couldn't be a better time and there couldn't be a better city. And even though we talk a lot about what's going on with startups, there's a lot going on uh, in, in, in the halls of the big companies here in Chicago. Uh, there's really a major move to adopt and deploy mobile technology. Uh, Sears, which has uh, a couple hundred people right down the street from uh, this location around the corner on, yes, right, right above the Sears building, there are a couple of hundred people that are uh, software developers involved in interactive media, uh, web developers, mobile developers. They've got Android applications, iPhone applications that are really trying to rewrite you know, the history of a hundred year old organization. And so for those of you that are developing mobile apps and developing entrepreneurship strategies, don't just think that it's all on you and you've got to break the mold and the paradigm just doing what you're doing. Right now is a time where if you knock on anybody's door, whether, whether it's Allstate Insurance or Baxter Labs or Abbott Labs or, or Hospira or any of the number of large companies and organizations that are innovating, the thing that we have in Chicago that a lot of markets can't claim is we have strong business presence in literally every industry group. This isn't a, a, a one-horse town or one-trick pony, it's high-tech or nothing. We've got banking, we've got finance, we've got the mercantile exchange, we've got communications, we've got transportation, logistics. So all of these vertical markets, B2B, B2C, are all uh, fascinated with the concepts of what a mobile deployment, mobile applications, uh, mobile development can do. And that's really what this idea of Mobile App Expo is all about, is to bring uh, you guys, the solution providers, together with the marketplace so that business can take place. And the bottom line is economic development and jobs. Uh, we don't view this as just a, a fancy pastime or time to pat ourselves on the back, but this is a time to really establish businesses. And as you heard from our last speaker, a capitalist coming to the table, there's money at the, at the table, there are entrepreneurs that have been there, done that, grown companies, sold them, merged them, uh, took them public, and they're looking to reach out and, and be a part of this effort. So uh, again, I want to thank Raymond for introducing me to Darren and telling me about this thing called Mobile App Expo. Again, we met right up at the Tech Nexus at the ITA, there are many, many other organizations that, that we're involved in from meetups to to, to uh, vertical market type groups so it's too many to name but I'm just happy that you guys uh, again we only decided uh, two weeks ago that we wanted to do this and but this is not going to be the last event to really put the spotlight on you the developer community uh, the user community the business community and hear from some of the different perspectives about why uh, your company can grow be successful and create a whole bunch of jobs in Chicago so that's all I have to say. I also uh, am the producer of a TV show called Technology Access Television. It's a weekly show that comes on cable TV. And um, I've already done a ton of shows about uh, mobile and mobile entrepreneurs. I've had Mobile Zipper. I've had a lot of companies that have startups here in Chicago. So if any of you guys uh, think you want to get the word out to every cable TV home and uh, TV viewer in Chicago, uh, no charge, it's free, just want to help promote Chicago's entrepreneurship community. One of the knocks we get in Chicago is that our press 
doesn't cover entrepreneurs, doesn't cover business, doesn't cover technology. Uh, that's why I started this show 11 years ago. I'm glad to say it's still on the air. And if any of you guys got a good story that you think Chicago can't live without, make sure I hear about it before you leave today. Thanks a lot. Hey,